awards you're receiving today are a testament to your t compassion and to your talent. When it felt like the world stopped more than two years ago, you kept going. You were and you are always there for your communities. On behalf of your Maryland Hospital Association and the entire hospital field, I'd like to simply say thank you. You are truly heroes. The ARC Baltimore is the first to admit they are not involved in healthcare, but they certainly become COVID-19 heroes by continuing their mission to support more than 1,000 people with developmental disabilities to lead a fulfilling life. New protocols were quickly developed for staff working in 75 residential homes. New supply chains were formed. Online programs were created to replace day programs. Vaccine clinics were held and advocacy for people with disabilities ramped up. People with disabilities matter. Our, the people that we care about and that we support are essential parts of our community. And so the people that, the providers, we're not the only one that stepped up. We, you know, I'm so thrilled that we get this honor, but I have to say, I feel like I'm accepting it on behalf of all the disability providers in Maryland um, because we stepped up and did what it was unimaginable to us, I think, in the past. In the midst of a staffing shortage, a tremendous staffing shortage. Congratulations to the ARC Baltimore. And congratulations to all of our COVID-19 heroes. On behalf of the ARC Baltimore and the over 1,000 people with developmental disabilities that we support throughout Baltimore City and County, we want to thank our true COVID heroes, our direct support staff at the ARC Baltimore. Thank you!